And we are back with another episode of Inscriptions, episode three. I had such high hopes for the last one. Why do I bother trying to teach you? You will learn as we go, or you will die. Okay. A gift from the angler. You see, he was defeated recently and wishes to redeem himself. It would be unfortunate if you were to fall to the prospector before he was even given that chance. Or he was given that chance. This hook is powerful. You may steal one of my cards with it. For this reason, you will not find any others along the path. Use it wisely. A hook is really good, actually. Uh, your starting deck. Yeah, so if you guys notice, the stink bug and the stoat look completely different now. I don't know why. Like, slowly over... I, I'd have to look back, but slowly over the last episode, they, they start looking different. They got different carding, uh, card art now. They still talk. And they still have the same personality, but they look different. Um... <clears throat> All right, let's go. Let's go get a card real quick. Worker at Wolf Club, Pronghorn. Oh, so this is kind of like the Mantis. That's actually pretty good. I don't like the ones that move too much. In fact, I might prefer the Wolf Club Cub because it costs one. Yeah, I'm gonna get that. But I mean, the sigil's good. Let's get up real quick. Let's look around. Anything else different? No. Oh, there's mushrooms here. I don't remember there being mushrooms earlier. Wait, didn't I already do this? Wait, didn't I already do this? Did not save? I'll put the plant down again. Huh. Okay. That's about the same. Uh, can I get the smoke? No. I get teeth. That's a lot of teeth. There's mushrooms again. Uh, I already did all of these, right? Yeah, there's nothing else to do. All right, back to the game. Oh, I haven't done this clock yet, but... Yeah, I don't know how. So, we'll just keep, we'll just keep playing. All right. Uh, let's go to Totem. Totem, pretty OP. Came across a woodcarver who fixes her intense gaze upon you. After an overlong moment of silence, she moved to offer her carvings. All right, so we have the squirrel head. So this back here is what we have. So we can give them airborne, or we can give them mighty leap, or we can get a crow. Uh, I see no point of getting either of these for the squirrel. So I'm just gonna get... Actually, no, my, mighty leap might be decent. It's better than nothing, basically. It means I can block with my squirrels. Again, it's not very useful, but better than nothing. Okay, let's go this way. All right, squirrel. All right, so what are you playing? You're playing that. All right, so I'm going to play this. going to play stoat. Back on the board, yeah. You weird square head. Uh, we'll just do that. You know, I unlocked this this knife. I haven't used it yet. Actually, I guess we'll attack that. Enough. Hmm. What does this say? The user will place a weight on the scales. The pain is temporary. Okay, so I'm thinking it's... Yeah, I like the wrench. <laughs> like the wrench. So if we get in a troubled spot, we'll use that. I see the way as this is going. I concede. You may accept my surrender. Or you may finish this match the slow way. Oh. I accept it. I accept it. I mean, if you're willing to concede, I'm, I'm willing to accept it. I get teeth, but... uh, I have not seen this symbol yet, so let's go this way. You came across a hobbled man standing beside some boulders. You caught me off guard. Not supposed to see me tilt further down the road. Say I like me a gamble. If you can pick a boulder that has gold in it, you can keep it. Okay. Uh, yeah, I haven't done this yet. Let's pick the middle. No gold. But that is a funny looking vermin. Vermin. Keep it. Okay, I lo actually love the cockroach. Because of its... Whenever it dies, it goes back to my hand. Oh, and I can put it on something else. Perfect. 
Oh, I can't put it on somebody, somebody else. Never mind. The beetle's nice. Well, or what used to be the beetle. So I don't want to sacrifice you. What about... We sacrifice... Well, okay, well, first, what can I empower? <laughs> I guess empower our stoat and give it the wolf club cub passive. So it just gets becomes a, a two, three, I guess. It's not very good, but I mean, it's something, I guess. Oh, I hate these. These are always hard. Oh, well, that's not a very difficult symbol. All right, so let's play this. Now let's play our stoke. Bad play. <laughs> Shut up. I should have sacrificed you. <laughs> I, I'm actually going to get one of these as well just to get my bullfrog out right away. Because then I can get my stink bug as well. Perfect. My bullfrog can defend. Cool. Hype. Cockroach, okay. Now my stoat's a 2-5, so it gets 1-1. One, one. Okay, they have a bat, it's fine. Can't play my cockroach, so we just keep attacking. Oh, I get a bone when one of the trees dies. That's awesome. A draw card, alright. Do I not have enough bones for this? I just realized this card is actually really good because whenever it dies, it gives me four bones, but then it goes straight to my hand. <laughs> uh, I don't have four bones. Okay. Well, I guess we just don't do anything. Yeah, we just win. Oh, that card's so much better than I thought it was because it had that extra sigil. All right, let's get a card. Raven egg. Proud wolf. Why is he telling me what a wolf is? I already have it. Oh, there's a little mushroom here. Remember the mushroom dudes where we had two of the same card? I guess that's because I have two wolves. Or this will make me have two wolves. Uh, what's Raven Egg do? See, I don't think that's good. Let's get the wolf. Maybe if we run into mushroom dude. They can make a super wolf. Oh... Enhance its health. One of the survivors said nothing at all, but cannot st stop licking their lips. <laughs> nothing bad has happened yet. I think it's time you take one for the team, though. Or my cockroach. I'm so down. Do it. They're right about the flames. They enhance the creature's health. Spotting a few of the survivors drooling, you made a hasty retreat with your cockroach. Okay. Now that's another one of these. Again, the symbol's not that bad. They just move to the left. That's fine. Me again. Yep. All right, so let's play our stoat, who we have buffed. Total misplay. Oh, my goodness. I should have sacrificed you. You're so mean. Okay, this is actually pretty bad. Uh, Let's get a squirrel. I actually can't play anything. Um... I won't lose this turn. I might need to use the knife. Okay, I think I need to use the knife. But first, let's do this. This. And that. And I'm gonna use it. I'm gonna use it. Oh, God. Oh, God. Yeah. It's like the wrench, but worse. So much worse. I am blind in my right eye now. Oh my god. Okay. That's the price I pay, I guess. Oh, they have an alpha. He keeps saying he keeps saying enough. Okay, I'm gonna block. I kinda don't have another choice. Plus now I can play the cockroach, and now I can just keep playing the cockroach over and over again if he keeps dying. Nice. Oh, it's so hard to see. Believe it or not, you're not the first to lose an eye here. This isn't much fun if you're half blind. Perhaps you'd like to replace it. Oh my god, I get eye. Well, look at this one. 
<laughs> this one's all glowy and shit. And this one's got like a keyhole. Uh, I'm gonna take the weird looking one. Whoa. Find salvation in Cockdo Clock? Cuckoo Clock? I thought this was Dio. It obviously says Cuckoo Clock. Okay. Okay, I guess I've got supervision now. That was good. I'm glad I tore out my eye. Show me some exquisite pelts. Oh, I don't have any. You have none. Do you understand how disappointing that is? I must give you this. Oh, he gave me some teeth. I wonder what happens if you return empty-handed again. Uh, I'm gonna buff my cockroach again, dude. If I can. A group of starving survivors stood around a dying campfire. There's room for a creature around the fire, one said. The warmth will enhance its health, said another. One of the survivors said nothing at all, but cannot stop licking their lips. <laughs> nope, nope, nope. Do what you must. Let's buff it again, dude. Boom. Yeah, you always run away before they can do anything. So I, not, not a single bad thing has happened at the fire. So it's fine. Oh. Prospector time. Past an empty bowl surrounded by heaps of unidentified viable giblets and scantlets excuse me it seemed like the bowl was designed for a dog but what earthy hound would require a meal of that size where is that hound of mine oh he's got a hound i mean i guess he always does right all right so let's play the great smoke we want it to die so we'll play it here because it gives me bones when it dies uh, and then I'll play squirrel, bullfrog. Now I can get my cockroach on board, which would be really good. Oh, I need to kill the mule, too. Let's not forget that. Okay, so I got bones. So what if I do this? Then I sacrifice this. Oh, wait, hold on. Let's play a squirrel. Sacrifice a squirrel and the cockroach. Cockroach goes back to my hand. I get the bones. I can just play the cockroach again. That's amazing. That's awesome. It's like an infinite. All right, so let's get another card. Wolf, okay. Play the stink bug. Masterful. Oh, wait. I messed up. He's gonna turn them all into gold. Alright, that's fine. The cockroach still goes back to my hand, right? Okay, thank goodness. As long as I have the co cockroach, I cannot lose. I actually can't lose. <laughs> Easy, boss. Just pop that mule. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna try to do next, but... I have to wait. Let's play the cockroach. Oh, the, the cockroach is weak, though. That's kind of a problem. It takes a long time to do anything. His adder's not doing anything. There we go. Now it's finally doing something. All right, so what I can do is I can play a squirrel. Then I can sacrifice the squirrel for a stoat, because the stoat's better than my wolf slightly after one turn. All right, well, now I can kill his pack mule. That's good. Yes, give me the cards. Dang nabbit. What the hell are the cards I got? I got a Rattler. Well, I can't play them out, any of them, so might as well just keep, keep gaming. He's a game, he's life. Your lives are restored. Let's go. Choose carefully. And before I forget, I should get up and look at the cuckoo clock. I, I like, know I need to do that, but I forgot that I could get up right away. When a card bearing the sigil is played, you will receive a random item as long as you have less than three items. Oh, that's kind of hype. When a card bearing the sigil... You know, I haven't got the long elk, and he told me it should be used for something. And the card art freaks me out. But I kind of want the gek, because the gek is free. <laughs> Let me get the long elk. Alright, let's back up. 
Free of the prospector's unhinged gaze, you looked ahead. Oh, I can't get up yet. As the air grew humid, your boots became harder to pull from the mud. The dank smell of tepid water invaded your nostrils. You had reached the wetlands. All right, let's get up. Do I still have my funky eye? <gasps> I do. Oh. Yeah, so I just need to match it up, I guess. Okay, longest hand there, shortest hand there. Stunted wolf! Take the film roll before he sees it. Now, what are you doing over there? Turn face me. <gasps> you didn't see anything. I have film roll. There's also paint on this, like glowy paint on this painting. Anything else? Keep sealed? You have the master's eye. Does this mean the master can see me? Magnif Magnificus, can you see me? Can you free me? Who's that? The master's free. Oh, the end must be close now. Magnificus is free. It must be close. Fear not, I won't blow your cover. You just need to get a hold of that camera of his. Maybe if you defeated him, you would get a chance. <gasps> okay. Yeah, because remember that time I grabbed the camera, but he said he doesn't keep regular film in it. I guess this is the special film. Oh, are there more teeth? Did I not grab these earlier? Could have sworn I grabbed those. Um. Okay, yeah, this is weird. This is weird. Still can't do anything with these. Oh, maybe... <laughs> I'm looking at the rules because... Last time, the other thing was in the rules. I don't think it's in here. No, just the code. Okay. Um, let's go this way, because I like buffing. I, I like sacrificing cards to buff other cards. The trial blood. Draw three cards must have at least four blood to pass. They must be akin to pass. Let's have three sigils. I guess sigils would be the easiest. Most of my cards have sigils. Yep, easy. Magpie. Once a card bearing the sigil is struck, a bee is created in your hand. A bee is defined as one power, one health, airborne. Okay, so this one gives me four bones. When it dies, it costs four, five bones. Plus it has Corpse Eater, which we know previously. Okay. Sparrow, when it sacrificed, counts as three blood. Cost one blood, that's not bad. I think I'll go with the middle one. I've kind of got a lot of bones, except the magpie lets me search for a card, which is so awesome. Uh, I'll go with the corpse maggot. All right, now let's go over here. So I can sacrifice the long elk. I give death touch to I don't even I don't know the wolf very well I'm at your service he seems pretty hype wolf seems kind of hype he only cost one blood too that's insane yeah let's do that I guess a, I don't know a taste of my former glory Nice. So you can put more than one sigil on things, which is cool. We got this, though. We got this, I believe, in the heart of the cards. I have to thank you. How's it been? It has been quite bad. I am trapped in the body of a stoat. In the paper of a card. I see that. And I have, of course, set up a way to reset once more. Go on. Our player friend here, they already hold the key. So you found the stunted wolf. I have seen this play out enough times to know that a plan is in motion. Make haste. Okay, hype, 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 hype. I love that there's like a story to this game. 
And as the more you play it. Bad play. Oh, shut up. You know what? <laughs> yeah, get out of here. Same bad play. Who do you think you are? Friendship ended with Stoat. Now Wolf is my best friend. Wait, he has a Mantis God? Or is that just regular Mantis? It's just a regular Mantis. Okay. Did they say ow that stings because they have bees? Is that why you said that? Good. They got a lot of bees, don't they? Where's my corpse? My, my, uh, my roach? Doesn't matter. Okay, cool. Let's go. Let's go left. Totems are awesome. Okay, we know the skink. A slippery hunter. So this has that waterborne sigil. Okay. Ringworm. This value is not readily apparent. Let's go with the middle one, I think. Alright, give me a totem. Give me a good totem. OP totem, come on. Airborne. Uh, <laughs> I don't really have idea either of these. I guess get airborne and just stick with what I got. Maybe I'll get a better totem later. All right, so can't do anything this turn, so we just pass, I guess. I should kill the Rattler. It's too strong to leave on the board. Hopefully I don't die. Oh, I do. Ah, should have just stolen it, man. That was dumb of me. Painful to see. Yeah, yeah, that was dumb of me. Uh, let's go to the right. Rat King. Gives me four bones. I mean, that's good, but it costs two. Trash garbage. <laughs> yeah, sorry. It has Bell Rigger. I get I don't know what Bell Rigger is. Yeah, I'll take the trash garbage, man. I, wanna, I need to find out what Bell Ringer is or whatever it's called. Because it does have it. I could sacrifice you, which would not be useful because I don't have any ants. I can sacrifice this. Okay. Okay, that would make trash garbage not bad. But it would still have zero damage, though. Let's just put it on a wolf. It's safer. It's pretty good, though, because it'll hit my opponent directly, but then it'll turn around so that they can't kill it. You took the film role. Is that correct? My plan nears. It's moment of truth. But you must defeat him first. Okay, I'll defeat him. I'll defeat him. Don't worry, homie. Don't let me down, though, okay? Are you sure? I'm not sure. That's why I have you, right? Oh. That's why. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I was not sure. Uh... Oh, this is only a 1-2. I need to steal a card. I'm going to take too much damage if I don't. Oh, both are not good options. Okay, I'll do that. I'll sacrifice this to get my wolf to kill the sparrow. Oh, he hits directly. I forgot about that. So it doesn't matter. <laughs> I 
<laughs> nice top deck. <laughs> I mean, I guess. I'm not getting my cockroach much. Was that this? This that was this run, correct? Yeah. We're kind of at a stalemate right now, but I'll slowly be able to do more damage. Keep me alive. I'll try. I accidentally killed your friend. Or I guess not your friend because you said you didn't like him. Ringworm again. I, I don't really know what it does too often. I mean, I did use it to get the... What, the plant? Grizzly. I, I like the grizzly. I'm about it. Uh, Let's buff a card. Buff its health again. It's always health. If you must. Yo, know, actually, buffing the cockroach's health is bad. Because I want it to die. Uh, I think I should buff your health, dude. Nothing bad has happened, man. I don't know what to tell you. Here we are. The angler. You bring me fresh, fresh fish? Easy choice. Alright. Uh, our sigil sucks. We meet again. I right, got the wolf. That's good. I'll place him over here this time. Does good damage. Ah, uh, okay, so if I play a squirrel, he'll go after the squirrel? Yeah, okay, good. He's kind of hitting me for a lot directly, which is the problem. I don't have any other items. No, you're not doing it again, really? All right, well, we'll just do that again. So I actually wonder, if he steals this, does that kill the thing back there? Because if that does, that's awesome. Oh, it does. Oh, that's such a good strat. Okay. So now we're going to do this. We're going to do this. And we're going to go boom, boom, boom. And now we should get one life at least. Alright, so he's got the fish buckets, which I don't want to kill. Crazy idea. But what if I sacrifice these and do that? Because when I kill the bait bucket, he gets a shark. And that's how I lost last time, I think. Yeah, that was a great idea. The angler. Mind is hook. Play a squirrel or something when he aims it. Yep. I'm, I'm a step ahead of you. That will protect your best cards. Yeah, no, I, that was a good play. I did a good job. Alright, we killed you. And I got my life back. Nice. Now let's get a rare card. Which one are you giving me? Long elk. I do. Do I still have it? No, I don't. What do you do? When a card bearing the sigil is played, a chime is created. In oh, yeah. I don't really care for that. Yeah, I, I really don't. Strange larva. I guess I'll get this one. I don't know. Decent card, I guess. Let's go to the new area. You will need another map. The relief of the fresh air quickly gave way to a bone-shaking chill. You guessed at the path ahead and the snow increasingly obscured it. You had climbed to the snow line. All right, snow line it is. Trial of kin, that's bad. Trial of health might be good for me. Trial of power. Let's go power, cause it's less. I just need two guards that are two twos. Okay, yep, there we go, easy. Easy, easy.
An alpha that lets me search for a card. Hefty. Let's go alpha, dude. That's a good sigil. Uh, you know, I might go to remove... No, we'll just do this. This is basically removing a card, but better, right? Trash garbage. Uh, okay, what can I buff first? I could buff trash garbage. Or I could buff my strange larvae. Larva. Let's buff you. You're, you're hype. Let's give you... Let's give you bell ringer, maybe? Oh, no, it, it's not a sigil, so that's not how it works. Let's give you strange larva. So now you'll become a more powerful creature after one turn. I assume that's how it works. I mean, we've already done that once. Oh, I need a better totem. I really do. Okay, so let's do this. Then let's do this. Damn, that's a 3-3? Three, three? What the hell? That's not okay. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. Let's do this and this. Honestly, just block for now. I need, I need bones, so I need my squirrels to die. I have no bones. Oh, good. He moved to block. You're so hype. Oh, wait. It doesn't work because it's airborne. Ah, uh, my bad. Oh, we go to mushroom land or we can go to totem land. Let's go to mushroom land. Plus, this guy gives insanely good cards. Four attack power, four blood, six health. Let's go do the four blood, I, I believe. Oh, easy. I got the grizzly. Success. Cat. <gasps> when a card buried the sigil is sacrificed, it does not perish, but it gives three blood every time I sacrifice it. Oh, that's got to be it. Yeah, looking at the other ones, that's got to be it. Oh, that's so good. I hope I get really expensive cards now. Oh, that's so, 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 so good. Bring us two of the same, we'd like to experiment. Yeah, I guess take my wolves, I guess. You may not want to, or you may want to avert your eyes. All right, this is a good run. This is a good run. I'm actually feeling good about this. You have one wolf, a six, four that hits him directly and it can't, It's it turns itself so it can't be hit. Ooh, that's kind of strong. Like it's almost too strong. Yep. Okay. The only thing is when I draw, I actually don't get that strong of cards. <laughs> ah, the raven eggs are going to hatch. It's annoying. They don't heal, though, when they hatch. Let's draw a regular card. Grizzly, okay. Oh, this is so bad. I can't play the Grizzly. But if I draw a card, I know I won't be able to do anything. So I can block? Oh, the squirrel can block. Okay. Okay. Do I have enough bones for Cockroach? I do, okay. The problem is it won't kill the raven, and the raven will kill me. Or I won't block the raven, I mean. I, if I block, I can block the porcupine. I guess I can block this with a squirrel. Yeah, just keep, just keep blocking with squirrels, man. <laughs> For now, at least. Until I get back a little bit of my health.
I could get a grizzly on the board, but that would not be good. Just keep doing it. Just keep doing it. We're fine. We're not fine. We're not fine. I'm about to do a little bit more damage, though, which is good. Okay. Now I can draw something else, finally. Oh, stink bug. Thank goodness. Something useful. Trash garbage. All right. We seem to have this situation mostly under control. I want to see what that does. The bell. Sorry. So it has three. It has three damage for bell ringer. I mean, this is my bell. Is it? Is it one power for each turn? That was way more than three turns, I feel like. Uh, let's go down the middle. I need a better totem if I'm going to survive. We're almost already at the end of this like little map. At least five bones. At least three sigils. All right, we definitely need the sigils. Because a lot of mine have two sigils. Yeah, easy. Trial was passed. Vulture with the ant symbol? No. I mean, Alpha giving four bones back is kind of nice. Plus, I have two Alphas for the mushroom. Or do I have two Alphas? I think I do. It, would, it doesn't have the mushroom symbol, though. Let's go for... Let's go Pronghorn. Alright. Grow into a more powerful form after one turn? Or Waterborn? Again, I don't have any birds. So all of these symbols are useless for that. So this is just going to go on my squirrel again. I guess make him more powerful after one turn. That's slightly better. It means I can actually play them for damage. However, now I can't block Airborne with them, so that might be bad. That's saved me a few times. Let's keep going. Damn, these runs take a long time. Alright, let's play Bullfrog. Bullfrog's so bad, in my opinion. One, two... Oh, you have a 3-3 three, three on their first turn? Why? Oh my god. Is that my last... Oh, I should have... Uh, shouldn't have changed the squirrel. No. All right. Well, we're getting there. We're getting there. That was the farthest I've gotten in this uh, YouTube series. I have the film. Your death card. Beautiful. Though it could be used some death. Wait, what? Please choose a card to draw its cost from. Oh, man. Only expensive cards. I guess this. It's power and health. Damn, I'm not actually I'm actually not gonna get any of the cool sigils. Wow. Are you kidding me? Alright, I guess the alpha because it'll search in power. I can search for any card and it'll power the others. Did ask for your name. Um Actually give me one second for this one. So a commenter on the last video said I should do this. What if you name the death cards based on the user of the featured comment of the last video? So honestly, why not? So let's let's take you and you're going to be the death card for this one. All right. Oh, can I not copy paste it? But yeah, that's pretty, pretty, pretty good idea. I'm down for it. You know. So there you go, man. All right. Yeah, I can't get his camera. I, I got to beat him. Anyways, that will wrap up this next episode of Inscription. Make sure to keep watching the series. The story is unfolding, and we're getting there. But yeah, uh, I hope you all have an amazing day, and hope you enjoy this series. I do want to finish it for YouTube, and uh, I will see you guys next time. Bye, buddy.